Hello, 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 and welcome back to Blender Blunders. It's been a good week since we've been on, and uh, it's been a busy, busy week. I've been learning and doing tutorials and just sort of experimenting. So hopefully we can apply some of that to this and make some really good models. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and throw on our normal music and we'll take it from here. There we go. Perfect. So what are we gonna do today? Big question of the day. What we're gonna do today is we're gonna make some stained glass. I'm gonna try some really weird, different things today, but the, the ultimate goal is to make a piece of stained glass in a little you know, window. Sort of church, you know, I'm not a religious person, but sort of religious. So let's go for it. Pulling up my reference art. First thing I want to do is get the shape of the window perfect. That's going to be the most important thing for us here. So let's get that going. Okay. We're going to want to start with a plane and we're going to rotate it. I am going to loop cut it. Come on. There we go. We're going to get rid of one of our faces. Whoa, not what I meant to do. We're going to get rid of that. And we're going to mirror it. Boom. We're going fast. We're going easy. We're going to apply everything we've learned so far. <clears throat> okay. uh, as per the norm, our music for the day is provided by Stream Beats. Good on you, Stream Beats. You've really been doing it for us. So now I just got to make it look kind of nice and twisty. That should do. So we'll just go one by one and really try and make it look nice. There we go. This may be a good opportunity to test out remeshing as well. For anybody who knows, I've been thinking about remeshing for a while. That was weird. Uh, let's just delete this vertice and see what happens. That doesn't really help us. I'll just put one in there and I'll put one in here. There we go. There we go. Okay, now the next part is the part that I'm thinking is gonna be a little bit more difficult and that's we're going to put an inset into this. We're actually gonna put two insets into this and I hope they work. So we'll grab the whole face. We'll try our best. Nope. How are we gonna do this? What if I grab you, copy paste, sir? Earth. 
did it copy there we go okay so we'll go back to actually we can stay in edit mode this works perfect Okay, and I will just scoot it down until they meet. Roughly there is fine. Just like that. And then I can get into edit mode on this bad boy and grab just these two and extend them down. Right? Yeah, no problem. So we'll grab you and we will add a modifier, Boolean. We will take away this. That's weird. Okay, let's go ahead and scale this up. I guess we'll have to grab you and really pull you out. Okay. back a little bit it looks like it should be working and it's not let's turn off the mirror on that one what's happening why is it having so much trouble same thing actually we'll go ahead and just pull you out theoretically the intersection should be fine but it's not Try it again. Let's add the Boolean difference. This guy, we'll put it above the mirror. Super weird. Super weird. Okay, tell you what, we will join these two. Right, that should work. No, 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 none of this. Quit freaking out. Join, there we go. So now I got one mesh and I gotta sit and fix all this, but it is what it is. I've had worse fates. So we will destroy that. And hopefully this will give us a nice little, it doesn't. Why not? What? Hmm. 
All right, well, we're gonna do it the hard way. There must have been an easier way, but I goofed it somehow. That's all right. You know, we're not we're not here for speed. We are here for speed, but not today. There we go. Now we're gonna do. So we're just gonna grab points, make a face. Easy. Just like we intended from the beginning, you know? The easiest thing on earth. Um, again, I don't want to get too hung up on this part specifically. The glass is really where I want to be spending most of our time. So we're going to cross our fingers that we can finish this up here. Whoa. Something very strange happened at the bottom here. We can get rid of this. Yep, just like that. Wait, 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 wait. What did I just do? boys in the middle. Where are you? There he is. Man, music really sets the stage for everything. This is so nice, so pleasant. sure if I really understand how we're going to do this now that I'm looking at it. I think I might have lost my way. Tell you what, what's going to happen here is we're going to delete all of this bottom stuff. Doesn't matter. I need to worry about the back, so we're going to call it right there. What a strange creation we've already made. There we go, whatever. All right, moving forward. Appears to be a couple of different kinds of stained glass window. I very specifically was trying to make a trifoil. The shape looks a little scary now that I'm looking at it, especially given what kind of trouble we went through. But who would I be if I didn't try it? You know, that's not me. Paste you. What on earth? We got some really weird stuff going on here.
Okay, so it should really just be zero on everything and then 0 0.1 here, negative 0.1. Yep, that'll work. You can chill. Actually, no, you should go right up here. You're gonna be a very good boy for us. That'll be fine. We'll fix it in post. Story of my life. Okay, so let's do the same thing. And I think we can make this work. It's gonna be a little weird, but I think we can make it work. This is gonna be one of the messiest meshes we've made. Anyway, while we're doing this, um, yeah, so I took about a week off been doing blender for most of that week um, been doing just a bunch of tutorials just trying to really figure things out for myself and feeling really good about where we're at um, I've made a list of things that I want to improve on and I've misplaced it oh it's right in front of my computer um, yeah I've basically established what is the next step for me and uh, the principles that I need to be practicing are speed, form, detail, scale, which scale is scary. It's one of the weirdest ones for me. Um, editability, which we got to learn that right away. The ability to make a mesh and have it be ready to make models or like make um, edits on. Ooh, that's so crucial to what we're doing right now. So that's on the list. Um, efficiency, which is always a struggling battle. We're not being very efficient today, but normally efficiency is a number one. Um, and last but not least, texturing, which uh, I think we're gonna spend a whole stream on one day. Uh, I think I'm just gonna make myself something really simple. Maybe I'll get like a face or something and we'll open up um, Photoshop and see where we go with it. What on earth? Okay, so we've made weird disjointed looking thing here let's give this a shot color me worried here basically this guy's got to come down oh that actually doesn't look bad already Wow, that already looks really good. Okay. That actually looks so good already. I hate this bevel right here this is this is bad uh, I'm making extra faces for seemingly no reason but so be it Look at that, wow. That just kind of came together at the last minute, didn't it? Okay, tell you what, if I do this. Yep, and we're gonna 
get rid of these faces and just have that one. That does not look terrible. All right, so let's go ahead and grab all of these. And we're gonna move these faces back just a bit. We don't want the window to be too, too crazy. And then I'm gonna grab just you. Hello? I'm alt clicking edge and it won't let me. So I think I might've messed it up. Oh well. You are gonna come forward just a little bit. this crazy mess we've made. Wow, holy cow that came together. Goodness me. All right, so all we need to do is just grab this guy. I can't believe we did it. Cool. We are getting better. Man, can you believe it? If you told me I was going to be doing this in 20 minutes, no way. All right, so now begins the really challenging part. Um, I got to make the stained glass. Uh, you would think I would be smart and I would pre-plan how I'm going to do this. I didn't. Uh, my bad. What I think I'm going to do hmm. Okay. Let's just start with some very simple shapes and we'll take it from there. So we're in object mode. We're gonna add just a circle. Should be fine. We'll give it a rotation. We'll move her into position. She's a little big. Let's give her like a 0.5, that's way too small, 0.7. What's this gonna do for us? Uh, I actually like that, that looks great. So we have it nice and lined up. I'm going to It's a terrible ingon, but oh well. And we're gonna inset a nice little face in it. Why can't I do a face? Okay, I can do a face. We're gonna do 0 0.05. Exactly what we want. Cool. Um, it actually is exactly what we want. We're done. Kind of. We're gonna come back to it, but that's like it for now. Now I'm looking for my inspiration. Little 
rough. You know what? Actually, I didn't I didn't do this correctly. We do actually want it to be 0.1. have to like sketch all of our edges. Hmm, this is gonna get weird quick, man. Uh, oh well. We'll grab all of it. We will scale it. We're not gonna scale it. We're gonna go to edit, grab all, Extrude forward. That'll be fine. Oh man, oh man, I know how to do it now. Oh, I know how to do it. Oh, I know how to do it. Look at this. We're gonna bring it in by 0 0.05, maybe even less than that, 0 0.025. We have to remember this number. And it's gonna be negative one. Oh, it has to be way less than that. Negative 0 0.01. Yep. We're going to do everything like this. And then I'm gonna separate both of the vertices or both, both of the edges and we'll have it. This is gonna be so nice. Man, we're here. So, let me actually get a pen and paper because we cannot forget this. So we're looking at 0 0.025 and negative 0 0.01, I think was our measurement. It's perfect. Oh, we've done it. I love to say that we've done it. Cool. Let's keep this momentum going. Now, I'm not super thrilled that we made it like this. It'll be fine. We'll make it work. So we're gonna go back to object mode. Oh, it looks so good. Okay. We're gonna add a plane, rotate it up 90. I think we gave it 0.7 on both of its vertices. That's not gonna work for our Oh no, yeah, well, perfect. We're gonna fill this whole thing up. And then we're gonna extrude it just ever so slightly. I'm not super worried about how much we're extruding as long as it's greater than the amount that we are pushing into it. Um, but I do need to move it back. We're gonna be very precise about this. Right there. Okay. So here's how we're gonna do this. We're gonna grab this face. We're gonna make a little inset. 
Um, it's got to be 0 0.1. Yeah, that looks good. That's perfect. So we'll grab that. Um, what I'm gonna do is get rid of this face. Now, we're gonna grab everything on here. Hello? Why are you still here? You're not needed. Everything here. Hmm. Surprised it's only smoothing one of them. That's a little weird. Something strange is going on here. I'm just trying to wrap my brain around it. really need to do is just make sure these guys are flush. Yeah, this will be fine. So let's do a whole bunch of cuts. I see it. We'll grab you. Nope. We'll grab you and we'll delete you. We just want to delete that edge and then grab this edge and bring it down all the way to the bottom. Cool. Now we're back. And now I can very easily just do this and do 12. Let's do 14. Excellent. All right. We're going to grab all of those and all of these. And we are going to inset some faces. And it's going to be our exact measurement. 0.025 with a depth of negative 0 0.01. Cool. So we can delete all of that. Just this face. Now that everything is normal, put you right on there. Um, I really. 
really just want that one right there. And I really just want this one. really just want you right on there. Both of these should come all the way up. I do plan on joining these meshes eventually. Now, really key fact here, why am I not mirroring? Tell you what, we're gonna hold off on this. It can look like junk right now. That would be perfectly fine. Why don't I just join them now? While we're looking at it, why don't I just join them? We'll go into edit mode. We will remove this. And we'll just connect the dots, right? Who cares? fact, what I should be doing is I'm just going to subdivide this and then these can merge. Looks perfectly fine to me. Is it the prettiest thing on earth? No, no way. Lost a good amount of time on that, but it's not looking bad. Oh, I have another surprise for everybody too. Something else that I've been working on, but we're gonna get to that.
Okay, so let's go ahead and just remove all of this. What I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna grab all of these faces. We're gonna bring them together. Because we're gonna copy our previous thing. Okay, so I just need to literally repeat that. Triangle. This line here will do just like that. And what? Something goofed up. What did I do? Oh, I definitely messed something up over here. I see, I see what I did. We messed up, which is okay, because we're good at messing up. That's actually our superpower, is messing up. We're so good at messing up that we don't, we don't freak out about it. It doesn't hurt us. It's good for us. Okay, we're here. Having a little bit of trouble understanding even what I'm looking at. Right. Now, if I do it like this, this is gonna haunt us. We don't wanna do this. So we're gonna reset. Like I said, we're really good at failing. We're extremely good at it. We want, we wanna make sun rays. want this to look we want this to look extravagant so let's grab you let's sub subdivide you good number of times Right? How easy is this? Ain't no problem. We're looking perfect. Look at that.
So theoretically, we can come down every other one. Whoa, this goes down real far. Theoretically, I can keep doing this, right? I could come here. three subdivisions. exact same thing as before and make three hello we're gonna make three of these but we're going to not use that This got weird quick. It's gonna come over a little bit, come over a little bit. If it's a little messy, that's fine. I mean, stained glass was originally made by hand. I say originally as if there's stained glass machines. I don't think that's the case. I'm sure machines play a part in making modern stained glass, but I think it's probably still a pretty organic process. There we go. Now I can do this. I can grab both of you. fix this wall, did I? There we go. To stop that from being a problem in the future. So we will take it upon ourselves Fix all of this. Shouldn't have been so precocious in my ideas. do is we'll grab you all and we'll give you a loop cut. This guy can be formed. Okay, and if you see what I am working with here, we're in a loop cut. 
try it, it again. Oh, just an easy loop cut. There we go. We'll kill both of you. That does more damage than good, but oh well. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do it all over again. We've got Misfar. We're going to grab all of these. Not that one. All of it. And we are going to inset by our set margin. And this should set us right. What? There we go. Okay. Hmm. Nope. Wait, 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 wait. We need to do a little bit more work on this thing first. Let's merge those. Same thing. We'll put all the pieces together. Okay, we got 25 minutes. We are pushing the boundary. I want to do much more than this. It will have to do. Okay, now we'll go back to grabbing faces. Just like that, we will do the same thing, 0 0.025, negative 0 0.01, and individual. Look at that. Look at that. All right, so where do we take it from here? This is where things are gonna get a little strange. This is where I'm a little uncertain if I did things correctly or not. What we're gonna do is we're gonna copy it first and foremost. Get rid of you. And I am going to just start. I 
I'm just gonna start removing glass. This could be a huge mistake. But you live, you learn, that's life. I could probably alt click to do all of this, but I'm just a little bit worried it's going to mess up my selection. If I've gotten this deep into it, we're just going to do it the hard way. Just gonna go straight through. Oh, it's perfect. Oh, it's actually pretty perfect. Right? Holy cow. It looks so good. I mean, I don't necessarily love the bottom of this, but so be it. Okay, so you're gonna be called the iron. Now we have this glass. All we want stuff please be careful please be careful why didn't it save Wait a second, it didn't save. All right, whatever, we can manage. This might actually make things a little bit easier for us. Very frustrating that it didn't save the piece that we were working on though. Okay, I believe if I delete all of those, pieces left. Hmm. What are all these pieces that are being left over? I'm 
thinking I don't need any of this. Right. Sure, that'll work, whatever. Now I gotta grab all of you. And for whatever reason, you all got pushed forward. So now I gotta push you back. works. Hey, perfect. Okay. Uh, I can't bevel things until you select them correctly. Still does not work for us. All right, that does not like it. So we will move on to the iron. Tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna try the old one. We're gonna remesh this bad boy. Is this gonna work? I don't know. I feel like I didn't actually do anything and I might have just crashed. There we go. Let me go ahead and just save this real quick before it absolutely busts. All right. Ever this was gonna crash, it's gonna crash now. I've done it. I've gone and done it. Let's just kill it. Kill it while we can. Alright, we'll start her back up. Tell you what, we're doing a speed sketch. I got a lot to learn. I'm actually pretty proud of the results that we have so far. Let's not get fussy. Actually, now that I'm looking at this, I'm a little upset about the glass. I just realized that the glass is not gonna be, each individual piece is gonna be like shaded correctly. That's such a shame. Oh, by the way, um, new thing. 
I am using HDRIs instead of lighting rigs. Um, I'm sure this is a bit of a juvenile thing to do, but man, it makes my life easier. That being said, that one is really bright. Let's do a little bit of a uh, overcast. There we go. Look how good that looks. Cool. All right. So we're on the window. This is gonna be like a stony sort of texture. So we'll go ahead and add a Musgrave. That'll be its roughness. speckles and we'll just give it a nice gray slightly bluish color yeah it'll be fine there oh, I hate how like very clearly low poly that is if I had more time, I would fix that. Um, I'm not a big fan of the principled. I know that they're really useful and they can do technically anything, but it's just not for me. You're gonna be gloss. You're gonna be a really dark, like rusted sort of color. itself or the glass I mean is glass so we will give you glass color for you. This is where we're going to go a little nutty. This is where we got 10 minutes. Let's use our 10 minutes. Okay, we're looking at holy colors. So we got to got get it got to get that marigold. Now, this might be cheating a little bit, but I am going to use a Vernoy to do the factor. Oh, it just looks bad. Oh, I don't like that. I'm a little disappointed. We had so much potential and we kind of dropped the ball right here at the end. Oh well. It is what it is. just wish like I could have 
tiered each individual piece of glass. I wonder if I can displace it. That doesn't really help us. Yeah, who needs displacement? All right. I suppose I can. Let's change our camera real quick. There we go. Um, I think we should actually rotate just a little bit, not that way. like that a lot that's cool okay back to the glass we're gonna put in some geometry that actually kind of works Per island. Hold on. That's doing some actual work for us. Go back to tangent. I mean, that's 100% cheating, but it does get the idea across that we wanted. What if we turn off the transparency in our world settings and I'll play around with which world we're going to use, but otherwise this is it. You know what? I actually think Venice would be a really nice place for this. Let's go to Venice. Where are you at? There it is, Venice and Sunset. Where's a good angle for us? We're 
just gonna spin until we find something we like. You know what? I like it on the water. It's silly, it's weird. Uh, okay. We're gonna grab this. We're gonna make this a little bit darker. We'll save it. It's a weird one. We tried. I think we got pretty close, especially on the outer window. I mean, I'm gonna work on this, you know, in my off time, of course. And this is usable. I could use this in projects. I just need to fix all these glass panes. But I mean, hey, hour, 20 minutes, hour and a half, this is, this isn't half bad. I'm pretty proud of this. It's not what I wanted, but what am I like two months in at this point? I'm not expecting to be doing legendary things. This is pretty good. Um, I'll go ahead and render this for y'all. Make sure we're rendering the correct way. Yep. Perfect. Let's render it. Rendering quick. All right. So with that, I'm gonna go ahead and save this. I'll throw it up on Instagram a little bit later. And we'll uh, jump on over to some Hollow Knight. See you soon.